This is my latest adventure for my chickens. Mealworms. I'm raising mealworms for them. These are the worms. I'm feeding them potatoes, carrots. They like to chew on this cardboard and hide in it. If you can see if it'll focus. And tea bags. They really like to hide in the tea bags. Sorry about the lighting. I really need to get a better camera. This is just my phone. See all the mealworms in the tea bags. This is their larva state. I've got the tea bag in there to help keep them moist so they can get out of there better. Oops, sorry about that guy. They look like little aliens. Doesn't want to focus, does it? Because it's like a little alien. And when they hatch out of that, they become beetles. Those are newly hatched beetles. They're still brown. They darken down to the black that you can see there. They also eat potatoes and carrots and tea bags. These guys lay the eggs in here and about once a month I'll take the eggs, the substrate, which is chicken feed, and I'll put it over here in this. And this is called frass. It's their poop, actually. And they hatch in this. And I sift through this, and I find the little beetles, or the little mealworms, I'm sorry. And I put them in here where they grow and become the larva and the cycle starts again. When I get enough that I have a surplus of them I'll start feeding them to my chickens. Some people use oatmeal. I have chicken feed. So that's what I feed them. Substrate is just is chicken feed. I ran out of I ran out of um, chick starter when I cleaned it the other day, so I had to give them all flock pellets. These things are super high in protein. It's so good for the chickens, it's ridiculous. And 
The chickens just eat them down like candy. I probably won't be feeding them to the chickens for another few months. I want to build up a big surplus because I have a large flock. But if you're interested in the whole process, I could do a video on the whole process. But they're pretty easy to grow. And your chickens will love them. And I'm sorry about the background, but when you're homesteading and your only piece of furniture is a bed, you have to kind of do everything from the bed. I hope you have a good day, and if you like my video, subscribe and like. Thank you. Bye.